Hi, this is Dan from MSS Enduralis, and this is going to be my first attempt at a vlog, so I apologize ahead of time if it's not very good. I kind of wanted to get on and explain why I stopped making videos and why it's taken me so long to get back and give you guys somewhat of an understanding of some things that I've learned over the last few months. Back in mid-December of last year, uh, because of decisions that I made, my family and I lost our home, our car, everything. Luckily we were able to bring in enough money to be able to stay in a hotel for about a month and a half while we were looking and trying to find a new home for myself, my wife, and my kids. And during that time, I learned a lot of things that I had taken for granted pretty much throughout my entire life. And it was a life-changing thing for me. One of the most important things that I learned was that things aren't what's important. You can have all the gear in the world, you can have all the preparations in the world and think to yourself that I'm prepared for anything that might happen. And it's not the big things that get you. It's not, you know, an economic collapse. It's not, you know, an EMP. It's something that happens on some idle Tuesday, just out of the blue, a small thing that snowballs and just takes all that away. And then all that's left are your skills, what you know, and family. You can't depend on anybody but your family. Your friends will let you down not because they're bad people in general, but I've discovered with my situation that people that I have been friends with for years have backed away and don't want to be friends because what happened to me was scary to them. Someone they, they saw as being stable and just like them, losing everything and having to begin again and rebuild everything from scratch. And so my new mantra has been mitigation. I still believe in prepping. I still prep. I still try to be prepared for anything that may come. But I don't look at it as this will solve the problem. I look at everything as mitigation. How can I lessen the effect of whatever might happen? I I'm determined that I will never allow my children or my wife to be able or have to live in a hotel or live on the street. It will never happen again. It's taken hard work, a lot of it, to get into a new home. We still don't have a car, but eventually we will. And it's just taken that extra effort and motivation to rebuild and start rebuilding. I have very little tolerance for these people who say, I can't do that, it can't be done. If you put your mind to it and you determine that it's important to you, you'll find a way to make it happen. Well, I just wanted to kind of explain why I've been gone so long and I think I've done that. Um, I will be making a lot more videos. i am already been back to filming. I am already back filming. Let's try to say that correctly. And hopefully I'll have some more and better content out soon. I hope you enjoyed that and maybe found something helpful in it. This is Dan from MSS Endurables. Until next time, take care of each other.